This video will explain how to set up your account on Google Search Console so that you can make sure your website is correctly crawled and indexed by Google. First, go to www.google.com slash webmasters and click the Sign In to Search Console button to log in using a Gmail account. If you don't have a Google account, you will be required to create one. Follow the prompts to create an account and then log in. Next, fill in your website in the empty space and click on Add Property. Google will now require you to verify that you own the website. To do so, you can upload a file via the FTP or File Manager, or you could simply copy and paste the HTML tag which is given to you under Alternative Methods, just before the closing head tag. In either case, click the Verify button once this has been done. You've probably noticed that entering a website into an internet browser either with or without the www will work. For instance, www.yoursitename.com and yoursitename.com would both take you to the same website. So, in the next step, we will verify the second version of your web address. Now, let's verify the www or non-www domain of your website depending on which one you've already added. Click on Search Console and then the Add a Site button to do so. You will not need to add the HTML code again because you have already added it in the previous step. For the next step, we will add a sitemap to both domains. A sitemap is a list of pages on a website which makes it easy for search engine crawlers to index your site. On the site dashboard, click on Sitemaps to add the XML sitemap. Then click the Add slash Test Sitemap button. When adding the sitemap, enter only the file name and extension, not the whole URL. For example, sitemap.xml. Now we will set the preferred domain. The preferred domain is how the domain will appear in search engines. By telling Google that both www and non-www domains are the same, it will make sure that Google realizes the traffic coming from both domains is actually all traffic for the same website instead of two separate websites. This will help your website to appear more popular and authoritative to Google, helping your website to rank higher. To set the preferred domain, navigate to one of your domains within Search Console. Click on the gear icon and select Site Settings. Then select the preferred domain, either www or the non-www domain. Next, we will test the robots.txt. Navigate to Crawl and then Robots.txt Tester. Enter in the Robots.txt URL, which should be in the root folder. Then click Test to make sure Google is able to crawl the website pages you want them to crawl. Make sure the XML sitemap is included in the Robots.txt file. If it is not, then add it via FTP or File Manager. Next, navigate to Crawl and then Fetch as Google. Enter a URL and either click the Fetch or Fetch and Render button. This will tell Google to test if it can crawl the page and then return any errors that it finds. Click on the results and fix any errors that appear. Next, click the Submit to Index button. After you click the Submit to Index button, a pop-up window will appear. Select the second option, crawl this URL and its direct links, and click the Go button. Congratulations! You have now set up Google Search Console. You have successfully made sure that Google knows about your website and how it's structured, so that it can crawl it and all linking pages.